Oh no! Just when you thought it was safe to go back in the water, today it's Jaws! Surgeon General's warning you must wait at least 30 minutes after eating to watch this video. The other day I went and saw Jaws in the theater, and I gotta say something. Well, first of all, see it on the big screen if you ever can. Shit holds up. There are very few movies older than me that still stand the test of time. I mean, it's The Wizard of Oz, it's The Godfather, it's Star Wars, it's Crossroads, starring the great, soon-to-be-late Britney Spears. That's not a threat, but a prediction. Y'all better not Kyle gas my ass. Back when I was a kid, and I saw, I don't know, I gotta drop the southern accent or I'll just keep doing it for the whole video. Back when I was a kid, I loved Jaws, but it's interesting how time and wisdom color your appreciation for a film. It was the spectacle I was drawn to as a kid, but now I am so in with the town drama. I love the mayor with his head in the sand. I love the sheriff trying to sound the alarm. Hell, I even love that that leathery old broad on the beach saying, you weren't born on the island, you'll never be an islander, sorry. And of course, Quint, that old salty sea dog. Hey, Quint, I want to have your baby. Small town politics, it is the beating heart. It is what makes Jaws great. It's not the shark, it's the people. It's easy to see the mayor as a villain. The man's getting people killed, for God's sake. But now when I watch it, I realize that this is a guy who has the entire town breathing down his neck. He has the livelihoods of an entire community resting on his shoulders, so he doesn't want to believe it. He wants to keep his head in the sand. He wants to believe that there are maybe acceptable losses. Life is risk. And unfortunately, sometimes it comes undone for a couple people, but you can't ruin a bunch of other people's livelihoods for that. And it's only at the very end that he understands that acceptable losses are not numbers on a piece of paper. They are people. And it's when he says, my kids were on that beach too. He's not a villain. He's a human being, just like all of us, imperfect. I can see myself in the mayor. I can see myself in Sheriff Brody. I can see myself in Hooper. I can see myself inside that leathery old in more ways than one. I would not kick her out of bed for eating crackers. Am I right? It's 3 a.m. Do you know where your jaws is? Oh, you want me to talk about the damn shark? How the special effects didn't work? We haven't heard that a million times. Um, excuse me, actually, Jaws is the name of the doctor? The monster's name is Shark? F*** off! Go f*** yourself! Eat sh** and die! I guess I'm getting a little worked up. Look, if you haven't watched Jaws in a while, pop it in your VCR, pop it in your laser disc player, your DVD player, VCR combo, those are still floating around. Get yourself a physical copy of Jaws, pop it in whatever player you got. And do yourself a favor if you gotta take a piss. You wait till the orca is out on the ocean. You don't skip the town meetings. You don't skip the delightful interactions between Sheriff Brody and his wife. You stay for that Cause that's what makes life worth living. That's what makes connection, human experiences. It's called Jaws, look it up. Oh, whoops. You probably thought you were gonna get out of here without me motivating the hell out of you. Well, that's where you're wrong. Keep reaching for those stars. Keep reaching for those rainbows. Keep reaching for all those celestial bodies that seem out of reach because, brother, unless you dream, unless you put in the work, you ain't never gonna reach nothing. You gotta push. You gotta look yourself in the mirror and say, today, I'm gonna give it all I got. Maybe I don't cross the finish line, but it's not gonna be because I didn't give it everything I had. I don't care if you're second, first place, second place, 10th place, 100th place. If you gave it your all, you won, baby. You won. Thank you for being you. Thank you for making the world a little bit of a less dark and dreary place. 
Thank you for everything that you do, everything that you contribute to the world. And believe it or not, no matter how small, no matter how big, you think you don't contribute, you contribute. You make somebody's day better. You make somebody's life better. Thank you, my God. It was a, I mean, it was a gentle mic drop onto a padded couch because I'm not made of microphones, okay? I'm not made of microphones, thank you.